For me, to be able to join RMI in this adventure was hugely exciting. It's such a courageous, bold move by an established financial services brand to be saying, let's go out there and reshape the industry. This group has been part of building some of the most iconic um, businesses in, in, in the South African economy. Um, and it's led by phenomenal people. The values of this firm is what I'm attracted to. I'm a very values-driven person, and I think the opportunity to work with people like the R&B founders, to work with people like the founders from Outurance and Discovery was amazing, and to be mentored by them was, was a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. I started at McKinsey as a consultant, so that helped me analyze industries and to understand businesses at quite a fundamental level, at quite an operational level. I then also spent time at Standard Bank in corporate venturing, so I could understand how does a large corporate partner with entrepreneurial businesses to try to bring innovation into the mainstream. I then was a, a founding member of a digital banking startup which got sold to CBA. So I've got an entrepreneurial background and I have a deep understanding of what the entrepreneurs we're working with are going through as I've walked that entrepreneurial journey myself. I think what's, what's hugely exciting is that financial services is so transformative. Um, we've got so many people in South Africa that haven't previously been able to access financial services. And as I said, we've got an entire generation, this millennial generation, who are accessing financial services in such a different way. Banks aren't relevant to, the, to, to them in the way that they were to our parents. So I think to be part of that journey and to be interacting with these amazing young people who are so energized and see the world so differently, it's like a dream come true. To be able to work with, with entrepreneurs who have a vision for changing the world, that's what gets me up every day.